hello everyone so in this video we will see how to make an environment monitoring system using arduino uno and lcd display so let's see the connections so first of all we have dht11 sensor that is the digital humidity and temperature sensor so i will fit dht sensor here like this so as we all know the pins of the dht sensor that is ground data and vcc so i will connect ground to arduino's ground so here is my ground let me connect it to here the ground pin the second pin was data pin so i will connect the data pin to the pin number 4 of the arduino uno so here is pin number 4 pin number 0 1 2 3 and here is pin number 4 lastly i will connect the power pin that is vcc to the power pin vcc or 5 volt of arduino so here i connected okay great now my sensor connection is already done now let's do the lcd connections so as we all know lcd have four pins so first it have ground then vcc then sda then scl now let's do the lcd connections also so first of all we have ground so let's connect ground to the ground after that we have vcc so let's connect vcc to the 5 volt so i connected vcc to the 5 volt then we have sda so we need to connect the sda to the a4 that is the sda for the arduino uno so here sda went to the a4 pin after that we have scl so let's connect scl to the a5 of arduino uno so here i connected the scl and on this side i am connecting to the a5 that's it our connections are done for environment monitoring system now let's quickly jump on to the code and understand how it is working so we already know that we connected the dht sensor to the pin number 4 i included here dht library so in case the library isn't installed you can just go to this icon library here you need to type dht once you done that you will find all the required library so i went for adafruit library here as you can see dht sensor library by adafruit so you need to install this library and another library i am using is liquid crystal i2 c this library so and for this 
I went for prank D. Rebender. This person's library. So here by clicking on install button, you can install the library. Once that is done, now let's see the code. So I included the I2C library. I included the DHT library. I defined the pins for both. After that, in setup part, I begin the DHT sensor. So now my Arduino board is start communicating with DHT sensor. Also, I begin the uh, LED, that is the back light. So once LCD is initiated, after that I set the cursor to the zero, zero, means at very first pixel. And then I am reading the humidity from the DHT sensor and I am presenting it in percentage. And then I am reading it the temperature and I am presenting it in Celsius. And meanwhile, I am printing all this data on LCD display using the LCD dot print command. I hope you understood it. So now let's compile it. Once the compilation is done, we will upload this. So I hope you understood the code. Let's see the demo next. Once I uploaded the code to Arduino Uno, now as you can see the everything is working perfectly fine. So right now we can see the humidity of this area is 54.3% and temperature is 32.70 degrees celsius so let me bring the heat here so i don't advise you to do at home it could be the fire hazard so it is just for the demonstration purposes so as you can see temperature went up so it will take some moment to reflect the temperature on your display so as you can see the temperature is increasing and humidity is decreasing because I have brought the heat that will burn down the moisture from the air and that will raise up the temperature so overall as you can see the temperature increased and humidity decreased. So I hope you understood the working of environment monitoring system and how to make it and how to make the circuits and how to program the Arduino board. So that's it for this video. See you in the next video, till then, bye.